Whoa, what's them? Today's video is on rappers and commercials. Now, if you new here, what we do here is read, listen, watch, and we block talk, break that shit down. But today we just ran just to start getting videos off quicker. Let's start with the one in the corner, Popeyes, which one of your favorite rappers on it. Megan the Stallion, Heidi Sauce. Let me just calm down as I think about that commercial, y'all. Did y'all see the commercial with her singing hands on my knees, shaking my ass to this thought shit? Thought shit, y'all. Now, what's the definition of a thought? A slut, y'all. A slut. You might try to break it down to where it's cute to some of y'all, and some of y'all might actually buy that being a thought is liberating or female empowerment. To you, I say, sit your ass down. This video is not for you. And anybody else, you might be one of the idiots who defending just your favorite celebrity. You sit your dumb ass down because it's bigger than Nino Brown, goddammit. Now, look at the name of it hottie sauce doesn't it sound familiar like thotty sauce thotty sauce which is slutty sauce and look who they got her right there and y'all some of y'all probably don't even see the hand signal yeah that's the 666 but i'm gonna i'm gonna leave that for another day before that scare y'all off you understand what i'm saying but y'all this is what we resorted to. Don't you understand that this is an insult to black people? That they think the only way to sell some chicken hot sauce to you is to call it Heidi sauce with a female shaking her ass to slut shit? Do you understand that, people? Do you understand that? Or do you think he just hating? Are you still on that defending Megan Thee Stallion? Or is you buying the media narrative about being a slut? Slut somehow being liberating. They not walking around saying be a lawyer, go to college and all of that. All they doing is saying be a thought, be a slut, have sex because that's liberating because you get to have sex whenever you want, just like men. By the way, men who do that ain't shit either. Men like them dumbass rappers who walk around saying he have sex with every gal in the rail and all of that dumb shit. That is not cool either for some of you simpletons because what they not saying is they caught a goddamn disease from every girl in the world what they not saying is wear a condom if you talking to every fucking girl in the world god damn it they not saying none of that and whatever you want to do with your genitals is your goddamn problem but when you think that that's the only way you can sell some peanut butter or some chicken to niggas chicken to the niggas then we have a motherfucking problem y'all you understand me let me calm down lightweight lightweight you are witnessing the rebel network as we go to the next slide i'm still looking at megan the stallion though y'all actually buying this popeye sitting up there making you look like a complete fool oh we know how to get the niggas to buy it hands on my knees shaking ass to some slut shit and all the niggas gonna be looking at her body they'll buy our chicken all the females will want to be a slut like her and they gonna buy our thotty sauce our slutty thotty sauce do y'all understand what's going on here or is you thinking about your favorite celebrity but i'm i digress let's get to nelly now see that commercial y'all it really exposed a lot you dig if you pay attention see right there you see two different nellies don't you they say the one in the white is the cornell williams or whatever his last name may be god damn it and on the left is the one that's nelly the rapper you know what that tells you is that nelly the rapper is not real he is a character made up by cornell who is a businessman he created nelly the character to sell you bullshit Shit, like selling drugs, buying rims, having lots of promiscuous sex. Sex. You understand me, people? Let's be honest about that. Now you should understand that they have on two different colors. One have on white, one have on black. Doesn't that usually mean one is good, one is evil? But in this case, people, both of them evil. Because if the Cornell on the white, 
I mean, on the right with the white on was so good. He wouldn't have created an evil character in order to benefit himself financially. Do y'all see what's going on here? And you know what else they telling you? They telling you that we create these rappers and we'll use them to sell absolutely whatever we want. We can get them to sell Popeye's, Burger King, Hennessy, Seagram's Gin or whatever. And we can insult them in the process, y'all. And we could insult them in the process. Let's slut Maggie the Stallion out, yeah? I mean, y'all, let's slut her out, whore her out. Let's put her on a video half naked. Let's make our little slut uh, walk down a stroll and sell our hot sauce. Oh, let's get uh, Cornell to use his made up character of Nelly to sell our burgers while also exposing that rappers are not real. Why y'all think every time y'all see them clowns on the news, they wear a suit, they go to talking proper and everything. That's the real them. When you saw Rick Ross and them with a suit on on CNN, that's the real them. When you saw young Jeezy talking like a goddamn college graduate from Harvard, that's the real Jeezy. Well, sir, welcome to CNN. Why, why it's great to have you. I'm young Jeezy from the uh, Atlanta rappers base. They created me in a lab. You understand what's going on here? And by insult them in the process, y'all, let's go down to the one at the bottom. Look how terrible they got Nelly looking now maybe y'all don't know what the insult is but the insult is to southern rappers who they say sound like they have peanut butter in their mouth and he set up there and emboldened the stereotype you see him he got in the boot and at first when he was talking regular he was messing up oh people couldn't understand it oh man I'm messing up then he put some jiff in his mouth and was saying nothing but jibber jabber people jibber freaking jabber jibber fucking jabber y'all you are witnessing the rebel network and then he said it was hot do you see what they doing to him do you see what they doing to other rappers from the south saying that y'all sound like you got peanut butter in your mouth and that your rap skills is trash they humiliating you and selling jiff peanut butter all at the same time y'all do y'all see what's going on or maybe it's just me huh maybe i'm out here hating again it's block talk news boy he hating once again and that dude who is that again um uh, what is that boy name? Married to the white girl, like most of them. Uh, Travis Scott. That's Travis Scott selling you a nice McDonald's poison burger. You see that, y'all? And by him being a toy, that lets y'all see something else. Do you see it? Y'all see it? I see it. He a puppet. That's what they showing you, that they pulling the strings, that they can make his ass sell that commercial, sell this puppet, sell this poison, I mean. My bad, y'all. You see how his hands is in the sky? He's they toy. They made up little mascot. You understand me? All of these videos expose the individuals and it exposes and insults the viewer. It exposes and insults the viewer as well. Oh, you stupid enough to buy that thotty slutty sauce because we got a half naked Megan the Stallion throwing up a 666 on that picture. Or maybe you got scared because he on that, that conspiracy stuff. You crazy. You're a nut job and all the other stuff that mainstream media said I should believe. Some of y'all really, really that stupid. Oh, uh, man, he just hating on Nelly, man. Nelly is Nelly, man. That's the same person. But yet when you see his ass on CNN, he gonna tell you his name Cornell and all the other business ventures he got and everything. But when he Nelly and around you on at your award show, he gonna be thugged out with his thug gear on and all of that crap to sell to y'all, to sell records, to sell materialism. And you know I'm telling the motherfucking truth and look a looter and all of that bullshit looter from the side and all of that man sit your stupid ass down that let y'all know these boys ain't nothing but puppets just like that clown travis scott who is the last picture in the corner over there all three of them should have been a toy because that's exactly what they are and to whoever think i'm hating on one of these celebrities that you are very fond of you should be gone by now because you're ignorant god damn it the only people who survived these videos are the very intelligent people
people who want to see the goddamn light. I'm not begging nobody to be here or else I would have been gone 11 years ago, goddamn it, because I've been out here. I've been out here. Once again, y'all holler at me. <laughs> you are witnessing the Rebel Network.